Let us now take some examples on the angle sum property of a triangle. So let us say I have a triangle A, B, C. This particular angle is 30 degree, that is 70 degree and you have to find out what's the value of this angle, right? So basically we know that the sum of all these three angles is equal to 180 degree. So let's call this angle as angle C. Now we know that 70 which is angle A plus B 30 plus angle C is equal to 180 degree. Right? Or in other words angle C can be written as 180 degree minus you take 70 to the other side so it becomes minus minus 30 or angle C is equal to 180 minus 100 is equal to 80 degree right so this was one of the simplest one let's take another one let us say You are given a triangle A, B, C, okay? And you are told that X is e angle A is equal to X degree, okay? Angle B is equal to 2X degree. And C is equal to 3X degree. So basically, one angle is whatever degree it is there. The second angle is twice the first one and the third angle is thrice the first one right this is also fairly easy so we know that the sum of all these three has to be 180 so we write x plus 2x plus 3x is equal to 180 degree if you add all these you will get 6x is equal to 180 degrees which implies that x is equal to 180 divided by 6 or 30 degree. Right? Now we know a is equal to x. So a is equal to x is equal to 30 degree. b is equal to 2x is equal to 2 into 30, 60 degree. c is equal to 3 times x is equal to 3 into 30, 90 degrees. Right? Please don't go by the formation of this particular triangle because ideally the formation should have been something like this. But we are discussing more on the concept so I didn't kind of get into this. So this should have been x, this should have been 2x and this should have been 3x. Okay because this is supposed to be 90 degree. Right? Let us take one more example here, okay? If the sum of two angles of a triangle is 100 and their difference is 40 degree find all angles of a triangle right so let's call the angles as a b and c right we are told that a plus b is equal to 100 and A minus B is equal to 40, right? So this is pretty simple. You just add these two equations, okay? So this will give you, A plus A will give you 2A, B minus B will give you 0, 100 plus 40 will give you 140 degree. So 2A is equal to 140 degree or A is equal to 140 upon 2, 70 degree right so a is equal to 
70 degree. Now A plus B is equal to how much? 100. Right? So B is equal to 100 minus A or 100 minus 70, 30 degree. Right? But the sum of all these three angles have to be 180 degree, A plus B plus C. So if this is 70 and this is 30, 100 is gone here. So C has to be 180 minus 100 or 80 degree. Right? So these were some of the examples on the angle sum property of a triangle.